welcome to Kids Academy. I love that part. Me too. But what makes this sound? That's a good question. What is sound? I'm Andrew, and this is Bali. Hello! Today, we're going to learn all about what sound really is. Sound is a type of energy. Sound is caused by moving things back and forth very rapidly. We call these vibrations. When a source of sound, like a car, honks its horn, the horn vibrates the air around it. These vibrations continue through the air until they reach our ears. Inside our ears is the eardrum, which then also vibrates, telling our brain we're hearing noise. Musical instruments like guitars take advantage of these vibrations. Watch as this guitar string vibrates rapidly to make noise. We mentioned that sound is vibrations, and sound coming out of a speaker or your headphones is no different. You can see on this speaker, we have a cone here. Now what this cone is gonna do when electricity is run through it is it'll bump back and forth and cause vibrations to come out and make sound for us. You can see here that I've laid the speaker on its back so that the cones are pointing up. Now I'm gonna hold this tray of rice just above the speaker I'm not gonna to touch the speaker because I wanna show that the vibrations are gonna travel through the air and vibrate our rice. For the most part, the harder an object is, the better it's gonna vibrate. So we have a couple of objects here and I'm gonna be using this metal pencil to bang against them, and let's see what kind of sounds we can get out of them. The first one is a metal water bottle. Now metal is a very hard substance, so we should get a pretty good sound. A lot of vibrations. I can even actually feel the vibrations in my hand. Now paper towels are very soft, so we really shouldn't get a good sound, a big sound from this one. Not much. Glass is really hard. So we should get a good sound from this. Now I'm gonna be careful as I do this. We do get a pretty good sound. Some things are actually made to absorb vibrations. The rubber on the bottom of your shoe is made to absorb the vibrations from you stepping on the ground all day long to make it softer on your feet. So it should, just like it absorbs those vibrations from the ground, absorb the sound from the pen. Not a whole lot of sound. Here's a neat trick you can do with your parents' permission. Get a glass like this and put some water in it. Get your finger wet and then rub it around the outside of the glass. As you rub it, you should cause the glass to vibrate and you'll hear it make noise. So Bali, we've talked a lot about sound. Sound is energy. And that energy causes vibrations. You're right. And those vibrations can travel through the air until they reach our eardrums where we hear them as noise. And that's how we can enjoy listening to music and watching movies and all kinds of other fun stuff. Well, that pretty much wraps up for sound. Go check out some sounds around your house. Subscribe to our channel to stay updated on new videos. Find links to our apps in the comments below.